news towards truth. And for that, we are calling upon the British Consulate and the BBC to help lead the way to influence the New York Times, MSNBC, Al Jazeera, Russian Times, etc. Uh, CNN, everything across the board, anti-Israel media bias is a fundamental problem. And we are here today to bring light to that. For a moment, I want to take away from the substantive issues of media bias and talk about why each and every one of us are here today. What this means to each of us. Because of false portrayals of Israel in the media, I have personally been labeled a Zionazi, an ethnic cleanser, a baby killer, a terrorist, and the birthright agenda. I was an item on somebody's agenda list to deal with. Because of media bias, I have had to stand up and defend my friends and family in Israel from my so-called friends and classmates back in the States. Because of media bias, I have been put on the defensive, able to speak up, only to say, no, that's not true. But after today, that's no longer true. And based on those cheers, I can say, I'm sure each and every one of you have a similar story, a similar reason why you're here. But we're here today to talk about truth. We came here today, we marched down the sidewalks of Boston, chanting, screaming, and singing for truth. That's what this march is about. This is an opportunity for us to come together, to remind ourselves why we need to speak truth to power, and to quote a mentor of mine, why we need to rebuke the oppressor. It is our responsibility to speak up, because if we don't, who will? Finally, finally, before I hand off this megaphone to Rabbi Hanan winner to speak himself, and before we go on with the rest of our days, I want to remind everyone what we've done here today. Students with a goal, students with drive, with passion, with dedication, inspired by our friends and loved ones, came together for a common cause, to speak truth to power and to oppose anti-Israel media bias. Take that message back with you. Take it back to your schools, back to your communities, back to your families, and back to your friends. We can continue to make this change. And because of each and every single one of you, I'm Yisrael Chai. I'm Israel.